Hello, I'm Praxis, creator of Resonite, and in this video I'll be going through a bunch more rewards from the MMC 2024, which stands for the Metaverse Maker Contest. It's a month-long competition held by the Creator Jam, where creators on uh, in the Resonite community, they have from February 1st to March 1st to create entries in a number of different categories. Uh, I'm one of the judges for this experience, and all the all the worlds uh, that I'll be going through today, uh, I'm going to be seeing them for the first time and I'm going to be kind of giving my thoughts as I go through them. Um, I only have like a bunch of them left. Uh, I've done like a bunch of like videos like on this, like because there's a lot of worlds in total. Uh, so uh, I just want to like, you know, like get through the rest of them because uh, it was my kind of goal to um, see everything so I can like, you know, kind of judge things as fairly as I can. Uh, see and also just to, like you know see like everything that people have created over the past month and have it sort of documented like in form of these videos so um i've been going through the worlds like in random order but what i think i'll do this time is i'm just gonna sort them by visit um uh, because there's only i think i only have like 13 worlds left um excluding some of the multiplayer ones so uh, just so I don't have to like hunt and pick through the list, uh, I'm gonna... Let's see... Actually, no, this doesn't work. Um, or does it work? I'm trying to search them. Let me go to the bottom of the list and see which ones are left. Actually, no, I think this doesn't work. I'll, I'll just show them... I'll sort them in a... Let's just go back to the random sorting and just... I'll, I'll just skip the ones I have been through. The problem I have like is like when I guide through them, um, because I've been going through them in a random order, um, is the more I've been through, the more it's just like visited, 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 so I can have to like skip through them. Um, so let's get started. So the first one in the list that I haven't seen yet is Make 10 by Recoder. This is in the game category, so I'm going to open this up. Uh, I'll see if this one requires multiple players. Uh, let me open this up. Hopefully it's a... Uh, it requires just a single player that I'll be able to test it by myself. Um, I do plan like, on grabbing like some people to like do the multiplayer ones, just to see like, how they kind of work. So we've got a simple world, um, like simple environment. There's a bunch of floating things. I'm gonna save this. I kind of gather everything as I go, even though I have multiple copies of it. So let's save this, save the link, make 10. Um, so we have a, so it's an entry by a recorder divided by zero EOD by Merpasek. Uh, press operation to make desired number. If impossible, press impossible. Division, ignore leftovers. Uh, consecutive correct answer, more score. No parenthesis, implement issue. Um, short game by recorder. Okay, so there's like some symbols here for division. Um, let's go normal first. This music. And sound effects, okay. So there's no music yet. And if I like Korean where oh okay. So I've got a Korean version and there's English version. Let's go here. Okay, make ten. Okay, so Okay, so I select the operations and this second so like make ten. So if I do So can you just uh like multiply these? It's gonna give me eight. Wait, uh, no, it's eight. No, six. Yeah, that's a six plus. Yeah, so that's a six plus four, that's ten, and I'm just gonna multiply by one. Okay, oh, so like it's like you know, it just has power go. Oh, so you always have to make ten. So one plus. How does it work? So. If I multiply these, it's gonna be four. I don't know, is impossible? So, oh. Okay, I could have said max combo. Okay. So I see how it works. So let's try going for the speed now. 
Da. So this is gonna be times make ten. So if only I could do three. Division is weird. The division makes this weird. So if I do this, this is gonna be two. No, that doesn't work. It feels kind of like hard to like do like speed and uh, is it impossible? No, it's possible. Oh, it's just yeah, I kind of go again. This is not a thing to do. First, so it's nine minus. I almost feel like this is kind of like this is pretty hard to do. Like like fast. I don't really do like much arithmetic. Um, so I can do five plus five. So if I multiply these, no. I mean, this is gonna give me ten, but then I'm like... No, five. Do five? Uh, that's a lot to like, work through, so it's five. So if I multiply this 25... I don't know. This is... This is like too much of time pressure to like, go through this. Uh... What if I do a plus? That's four. I'm just going at random now, like it's um I feel this is too hard. Uh so I could go this. Yeah. This is really hard. I was like nice with the present, it just feels the time crunch is a bit too much. Um, so I could do plus, it's like 7. 7 minus plus, that could work? No, it doesn't work. Times plus multiply, that works, I guess. This one's weird. So if I... So I guess I'm just on like one answer and it's just kind of hard to like work through all the options. So this is gonna be 7... 7 minus plus. Mm -hmm. I it works. Yeah, there's a lot of time crunch. Uh, okay. I'm just putting a high final score. Max come back with the title. This is really hard. Let me try the hard one. I probably won't be good at this, but I want to see like what it does. Like ten. So five. I don't think it's gonna work if I divide this. If I do plus, and I can can I get rid of that though? What does this do even, like, if I... I don't know what the operation like, ends up doing. Minus? Is it gonna work? So it's gonna be minus two, plus two. It's gonna be zero, it's not gonna work. Minus, plus, plus, I don't know. Uh, that's, that's like way too, too much of a time crunch on this. What's the extreme I got a number? Like ten. So if I multiply these, this gives me eight. No, this doesn't work. Ah, <sighs> which order of the operations they also like apply? This is like too much that I kind of think through like in such a short time. Uh, plus, minus, plus maybe? No. 
I'm, I'm not even thinking it through, like, right now, like, it's just... Plus it's 5... It's 5 plus minus, I think, no? This is... This is not something I can really do real quick. How many impossible ones to get? Okay. That was a pretty cool concept, but just feel the... This is like... At least for me, this is kind of hard to like do this quickly. But... Uh, it's really nice to like done like all the like pixel style and like the music and the presentation like that's uh, really well done. So this was the make ten by a recoder. So next on the list that I haven't played is the Star Star Sky Simulator by Mark N. And this is in the ESD category, so let's give this one a try. Mark in. Ooh! So we got like a star sky, which is kind of expected. Uh, there's a dialogue. Can I change this? This isn't your. Oh, there we go. Yes, there's a single option. There we go. Replace with moon, swapping stars. So we got the south, we got the west, we got north and east, and there's like a little lighthouse here. I think it's just like a um, decoration. I don't think. Can I go inside? I'm just that uh, I'll try to start with this experience. I'm already getting distracted. Okay, well, let's go back. Um, that's pretty cool. So let's see. Well, oh, also we have a uh, mark in public. I'm gonna save this. Education category. If you like it, please vote. Uh, license. Mark NASA. American Brave. Okay. Um. Let's see. So there's real time mode. Please stop. Watch out for flashing. If you want to move faster, I can. Rotation, time advances one second, it's five minutes. One hour, one year. Attitude. Second toggle things, sun. Const oh, so this just, okay. So the toggles the... The toggles the, uh... What's visible? Atmosphere. Oh, okay. Oh, I see. So, like, I guess it's because it's night here. Actually, it's a different time. Oh, so it's in Japan right now, I think. Can I click on the map? Nope. Oh, okay. Oh, so I can move it around along the two. So I can move it over here. There we go. Okay. So you can see like what a sky looks like. Uh, hold on, what if I move it to the US? So I think there should be there should be like daylight over there right now. Oh what? Oh you cannot go to the negative west. Do I have to like flip it like this? Okay, I have to flip it. Oh there we go, yeah. Okay, so it does. Okay, so Oh, okay, so like this becomes like it gives like it an atmosphere, so like it actually blocks out the stars. But you can disable it, so I can see the sun, and I see the trajectory of the sun. I can see like you know like where it goes. Um, atmosphere. So this is in real time mode. Okay, now I'm playing. So now it's moving, and I can see the sun moving. So I wanna faster increments. Ooh, okay, so oh, that is cool. So I can like see the ooh, okay. I can see the whole sky like moving. Oh, that is cool. Ooh, this is interesting. Oh, this is just weird. Like my brain just kinda switched like which way are we like rotating. 
because I was like, this is stationary, this is moving, and then my brain just switched was, this is moving, this is stationary, which is, you know, more accurate. Ooh. Yeah, it feel, like, feels like, like, the whole earth is kind of moving. Ooh. So you can make it go real fast. What else can you see here? What if I go one day? So it's like one day per second, and I'm actually traveling into the future. I'm getting like future on my vibes. Go one week. Oh my, this is... Hold on. I'm gonna turn the atmosphere off. Yeah, I'm gonna turn the sun off. <laughs> Let's see why those are options now. Okay, so it just spins like crazy now. Just spins. Screw one month. And I'm really traveling into the future one year. So this is spinning. But it's kind of remains stationary. And I wonder like if it's supposed to like wobble a bit or something. Does anything else change? Swapping stars. Like I'm gonna stop. Oh, we, I'm like in 2050 now. Uh, so let's just do one hour. Five minutes. Okay, and we can do like a real time mode. So what does this do? Replace. Replace with moon. What does this do? Swapping stars. Moon. Where's moon? I'm gonna reset the time. I'm gonna go real time mode. There we go. Oh, that actually turns that off. Okay. I'm gonna change this to be roughly where I am. There we go. Okay, I don't see the moon anywhere. It's the sun. I don't see anything change. Oh, okay. Oh, this call I can take it with me. I don't see anything changing when I change these options. Like it's all replaced with moon. I don't understand what it does. Wait, what does the rotation do? Lines, other side of lines, ground. Oh, we can disable the ground, okay. Question is, can I see anything change? I don't really see anything change when, like, I click this. Is the red one supposed to be the moon? I don't really see anything along the line. It's just there, or is the... Earth? I don't understand what this does. So I'm gonna go faster play. Oh, why is it going so slow? Oh, it's because I turned it. Oh, interesting. Oh, this is weird. This is very spinny. Wait, so if I disable the rotation, what does this do? Does this just like skip the... Like the rotation of the earth is kind of ignored, but like... Why is it? Is the rotation just like from... Where is the rotation from? Is it just like from like circling around the orbit? So like if I do it like one year, I think so, okay. So like it just cancels out the rotation of the Earth around its like axis, but like it's still going around the sun and this is where we're getting this. Okay. I see. Five minutes. Sun. Okay, I'm gonna do time reset again. I still don't understand what this does. Like, can I click on the stars or anything? Or... 
Oh, they don't seem to be clickable at all. I don't understand what this does. Oh, jeez. What? Oh, wait. Oh my god. I'm inside the sun for some reason. What? Wait, okay, wait. Does this... Does this, like, change what... Planet I'm on? I... It seems like none of these have, like, any effect. Except for the sun. If I disable ground... Oh. I'm on the sun. There's a compass here. Okay, this tells me where I am. I don't... I don't understand. Okay, let's advance it to one hour. Sun. And I'm gonna pause it. There we go, we got sun. I'm gonna change it to one minute, so it's there. Anything? I... I don't understand what this does. Do I disable atmosphere? Anything? Yeah, it doesn't show. I, I, I have no idea. Except like this make, just makes me beyond the sun for some reason. Moon, Mercury, Earth. There's like Earth. I don't, I don't understand what this last option does. But, wish for flashing if you want to move the recommend turn off. Yeah, that makes sense, turning off sun rotation. Latitude, can I just make it be like on the pole? There we go, I'm on the pole, so it should be like straight up and... Okay, and I can see like the sun is very... The sun is like very, very low, like... Actually, I wonder, because like it should change over the year, so like this is just kind of spinning around over the course of the day. So will it change if I disable this? Will it actually change if I speed this up like by month? Oh wait, I see Earth there. What? Wait, so why is Earth there? Am I viewing things from the viewpoint? What? <sighs> I'm confused. Okay, so this makes sense. So like now I'm advancing like days and months, which is should be changing like where the sun, like the tilt of the sun based on like where Earth is in the orbit, but why is Earth in there? I don't understand. It's over there, but why? Why is Earth like going around? So Earth is there. Venus. What? Oh. Okay, so is that. Li oh my god, I see. Oh, is it just so we can see the size of them? Okay, I see what it does. Okay, so I have the moon. The moon is over there. And this is Mercury, if it was there. This is Venus. This is Earth. Okay, I see. Okay, I see what it does. Jupiter, oh my god, it's big. Um, so this is like... I guess this is just like to let you see the size of them. Saturn. I'm gonna turn the atmosphere off. Um, Jupiter. Oh, Uranus. Neptune. I like the actual added rings that I'm... Pluto and Sun. Okay, this makes sense, because Sun would be so big, like, we would be engulfed. Okay, so the Moon is over there. And it just lets me see how big... How big, like, it would be in the sky, like, you know, if the Moon was something else. Okay, this makes sense now. Okay, okay. Okay. So... It's a pretty cool experience. So this was the Starry Sky Simulator by Mark N. 
So, give me a sec, I'm gonna pause recording for a minute. There we go, I'm back. So, let's see what's next on the list. So, next on the list uh, is Chaos Modern Terrarium by Showa by Hatsunonigen. I'm not sure if I'm pronouncing that right. This is in the Avatar Avatars category. It also has a Chaos tag, so I'm curious. So, it's a Hatsunonigen. I'm not sure if I'm pronouncing the name right, unfortunately. <laughs> There we go, let's give it a load. There we go. So, like in this simple world, there's a Shua category avatar, creator Hatsu, Hatsuno Ninken, or Ninjan? Ninken? Oh, so are these like avatars uh, that we can like try out? I wonder if this is like based like on uh, something. So there's like seems to be two avatars, so let's uh, try them out. Equip avatar, there we go. Oh, this one's a small one. I'm actually gonna move the camera like this. I'm gonna move my old avatar out of the way. So they seem to be kind of like anime kind of style avatars. We need to get like dynamic bolts. It's got like hair, I can actually see the hair too. Do I have any options? Oh, there's options, yes. It can be fun. <gasps> oh my. It's kind of interesting, it doesn't actually have like a... It doesn't have a face, it's kind of like sort of like missing. It's interesting, it's using like symbols. There's joy. Uh, there's anger. Uh, there's sorrow. Oh. Can I have multiple? Can I have all of them? I can have all of them at once. Oh no. Oh no. Experiencing all of it. Let me actually show you this context menu too. So it's like... Different options. So this one of the avatars is kind of like anime kind of style. There don't seem to be any customization options out of the box. Um, but it seems to move pretty well. Um, the hair gets a little bit in my way when I jump, but uh, it works. It's kind of a, like anime character kind of style. Let's try the other one. So it's the, this is the other one. It's also kind of similar style. Like it doesn't have like it doesn't have actual face on it. Um, this is kind of interesting. Um, let's see options, accessories. There's head. Okay, so I can toggle the head. Oh, I thought it was hair. Okay. Oh, it's like a bow. Okay. And swing in the wind. And there's a bag. Okay, so I can have a bag. Wait, uh, this one. There we go. There's the bag. Does it have... Oh, yeah, it has a uh, dynamic bones on it. Oh, the, hair, the hands are really short. <laughs> okay. It's kind of interesting. It doesn't have, like... It doesn't seem to even have any like visims or anything like that. The mouth is just static. It was like a mirror or something too. So we could check it out that way. I don't know if these are like based on some kind of like character. Also there's better lighting here. It's a little bit dark over there. Let me jump back into this one to see just to see it in proper lighting. Okay. This something like at least nicely set up with dynamic bones and stuff like that. The ribbon ribbon is like waving in the air. It gives it like more dynamicity. Those are pretty cool avatars. Oh, and I do like like how the hair like it's kinda of like stars. The hands are real short. <laughs> okay. So this was the Chaos Modern Terrarium Showa, something Showa by Hatsuno Ningen, or Ningen, or maybe something else if I'm reading it wrong. It's pretty cool avatars. Let me just fix up the camera. 
There we go. So, next on the list, uh, let's see. Uh, been through this one, been through this one, been through this one. Uh, next is Uptime by Shock Coil. This is in the word game category, so I'll have to see if this one requires multiple people. Um, I'll probably be able to like play it by myself. Otherwise, I'll have to like leave it for later. So let's see. Congratulations, you're about to relaunch your new highly anticipated indie game. Uh, now all is left to make sure your servers keep up with the demand. Well, no. Launch your game, pay attention to your servers, and keep them running. Just remember to keep your power up. Okay. Credits, play this thing. Look at Alice, OZ, Code, Lyoko, Dietho, Flicky, uh, Kiba, Shokoi, Lorne, Crones, Leo, Catboy Slim, OZ, Sunmap, uh, Tabitha, Moon, Worm, and Ipslo. Okay. So let's see. So this is like a... Okay. Oh my. So there's like a bunch of IPs, there's a bunch of plugs here. There's like a crank thing. Oh, music? Okay, that's just the music. There's a bunch of uh, Ethernet things. Okay. There's like plugged in. So okay, so some of these need like networks, some of these need uh, target IP. The score. There's a score at, on the top. That's how much power there is. Okay, so let's let's launch the game. Okay, people are happy. Okay, so what do I do? Set up time. How do I tell when something's wrong? The power is going down. People are happy. How do I tell when I need to do something? Oh, why, are it, why is it going down? Why is it going down? What's happening? Why are people unhappy? Uh, do I need to plug more of them in? Target IP. What do I do here? Why is it going down? I don't understand. Like, what... Like, none of this is indicating anything. This is red. Does this mean it needs something? Oh, why are they so unhappy now? What happened now? 58. Oh, the score is going down. Why is it going down? Do I need to plug this? So this one's green. Um, target 103. How does this work? 103. Does this... What is plug there? Oh no, now it's red. Uh, what's happening? What do I do? Uh, uh, wait, so this one's plugged here. This doesn't need this. Do I need to plug this into here? Does that do anything? It's plugged into the same number. Oh, it's over. Launch game. Okay, it's going down. So this one needs to go 07. Let's go here. Oh my god, it's going down real fast. What is happening? Uh, so this is here. This one needs to go... Uh, 9. There we go. Uh, this one's fine. Why is this one red? Does this need power? Is this not plugged in? These are kind of crisscrossing. I don't know which one's which. Um, is this plugged? Okay, this is plugged. This needs to go into a green one. There we go. Is that it? Is it gonna go up? Up time now. They're really unhappy. Uh, so this one's good. This one's bad. This one also, I guess, requires to be plugged into something. There we go. So they just need to plug them in into the right one. So these are green. Oh no, I know it's going... Uh, uh, this one is green, I think? This needs to be... 
four. Oh jeez. This needs to be plugged. One uh oh three. But there's something already plugged in there. I don't understand. Oh did it finish already? Oh. Launch game. And it's going down. Oh, do I have to like crank this up like something? Like do I have to like make sure the power doesn't go down? Up time they're unhappy, so what do I need to plug where? So this one's not plugged in, so I'll plug this one in. And this needs to be go 04. Oh, why is it going down while they're so unhappy? They're plugged in. Oh, this one's not plugged in. Is it going up now? No. No. What's wrong? These are all green. These are green. This one's wrong. This one is... Uh, oh, let's have to see with all these. Oh, this one is all seven. What? Did it just change? How much is there with more people? Oh, so why is it? It's plugged there. Oh, seven. Why is it... Oh, it just changed. Oh my god. So I'm happy, so... Oh, it's two... Two six, okay. Just goes there, so this one's fine. This one needs... This one. Oh, this one changed again. Oh my god, I literally just plug this one. It's changing way too fast. Uh, this one needs to go... I cannot even read that over there, there we go. Oh no, now it's going down, do I need to crank this? Okay, cranking this. More power. More power. Mm. So this one needs... Oh my god, it's keep changing way too fast, like I... Can't really keep up with this. Uh... And the power, does it doesn't have power. I wish this were like core coded because it's kind of hard to see like they're like crisscrossing each other. They're super unhappy now. Okay, this one's wrong now. Oh my god. Uh, one nine. Let's plug this here. Uh, let's see. Oh my god, this one's different again. Come on. I literally just plug this one in. Ah. Uh, this goes here. What? What? It is in the right one, what? It's... there. Why is it not registering it? Oh, the game is over. Oh my god. It's really hard to tell when the game ends. Launch game. Oh, they're very unhappy. Why doesn't this register? This isn't the right one. What? Do the server, like, IPs matter? Oh, it's 09. This is 09, what? Hold on. Oh, it's 09, what? Uh, what? Wait, does that mean it needs to plug into another server? Do I need to plug them between each other? Okay. Um, I don't know where that is. 09, here. Okay, so these need to be to each other. It's like way too much kind of happening. Oh, it's going down, do I need to crank this? Come on. Is it still going? Is the game over now? Um, let's wait. Oh no, it's going dark again. Uh, come on. Does the game end like when it just goes... What? Why is it going black again? Come on. I literally just did this. Come on. Uh, what's wrong? This one's wrong. Uh, this one needs 07. 27, okay. There I go, this one's fine. It's just constantly down, though. It's a problem. Uh, this one is different. This, this is changing like way too fast. Uh, 
two, three, so I'm gonna plug this in here. I'm gonna crank this up some more. Feels like like you would need multiple people for this just to like manage everything. So this one is wrong, this needs O3, this is all just crisscrossed. Wait, what? Um Oh this is plug oh it's ch literally just changed. Uh five. Where's the five one? Um there we go, does this need to go here? There we go. Oh, this one just changed. Come on. This needs a uh, two, two. This goes there. No. Oh my! It just changed. It literally uh, it changed like ten seconds ago. This is like way too much to keep up with. Oh, and the game's over. I know there's like any win condition to this. Like it seemed like I can't really keep up with it, like, like, too much keeps changing, like, way too fast, so, like, at the beginning of the game, it, like, the score was going super fast, but now it kind of, like, I can't even get it to go up. And it's kind of cool concept, it's just, uh, feel like the balance needs some work, because there's, like, too much stuff changing, like, way, like, faster than I can kind of keep up with it. It'd probably be easier, like, with multiple people, like, in the room, but for, I think for a single person, this is a little bit too much, so... We'll probably play this when there's multiple people around at some point. Um, see like how that goes. It is a pretty fun concept though. Like like it's one of those kind of like like feel like a take on like you know the like where you have to keep making stuff like with um, you have to keep like you know making food and such like uh, for the restaurants. Except this one's kind of more like tech like oriented. Okay, so. This was Uptime by Shock Coil. So let's see, next on the list. Uh, next on the list. Uh, visited, visited, visited. It's just the rows of visited ones. I have to sift through. Visited, visited, visited. I kick off. So next is Cloudspare, Cloudscape Harvest by Hardlight. Uh, this is the, in the game category, so let's give this one a try. So I'll see if this one requires multiple players. Hopefully like it, it's playable with just one, so I can kind of go through it myself. Gonna give it a bit of load. Ooh, it's loading in. Pressure leaders, we got the Nordwick, we got Chuck the Vox Otter, Nemo there. And fail. And we go check for Fox Otter, Nordwick, Forgotten Sin, Laprox, Autopilot, and Baxter. Is there more? Modeling textures. Um, there's. Uh, there's Nemo there, Nordwick, Ardus, Broderock, Chris Blackpaw, Dexy, Forgotten Sin, Ghost, uh, Z36, Irix, uh, Mahadma, Fend, and Phil. Sprites, there's Stark Sugar and Dexy. Translators Ghost, Fun Fail, Ice Cream Pie, Naborisk, Persona Non Grata, and Soto. I like how it says like an unre unregistered user. And playtesters, there's uh, Jackson and Crocky. Uh, team credits, assistant software, it's like stuff that was used. Has a nice presentation, so let's see. Orders. Wheat tomato eggplant. Let's see. Ooh, let's look outside. There's a lot of stuff here. There's pretty environment too. Um, welcome, so we should probably start here. 
Welcome to your new job as certified hardlight employee in the Cloud Spade project for harvesting. In case you forgot to attend the module for your profession or simply forgotten what you sign up for, we have provided instructions across the map. But the basics of your job are to plant, water, grow, and harvest veggies and fruits. <gasps> fruits. I like this a lot. Licensing also is created hardlight immersion CC by attribution. Um Let's see, so there's gardening tool. The gardening tool is your best friend. While it is useful as friend on this lonely island, we recommend using it as a tool. <laughs> you can use it to place plantainer's trademark, analyze your plants and harvest the yield. Make sure not to lose it. We don't have many replacements lying around. So let's grab me. So I'll wait a little bit. <gasps> it's watermelon, I don't need that. Silos, this is the silo control panel. Use it to deposit and manage your yield and sell them to us. In return, you get internal currency called Sol. We don't use real money because it would be way too expensive and lead up our company profits. So, there's a bunch of orders here. Orders, hard light, overseas, all their different island. Coworkers can help each other by issuing orders with their deepest desires. Because the orders are usually urgent, you receive a little bonus on top of usual selling price. Okay. No, yeah, there's a plushie here. Uh, let's see, your farm. Oh my god, 69 nights. My farm, we can name it. It's gonna be Fruxus Fruits. And just in small. And veggies. Veggies are okay, but I like fruits. So there's this fruits, fruits and veggies. Got 69 runs. Save farm. Oh! Oh, that's cool, I can save it. Ooh, I thought there's a lot of stuff. Okay, so this is using the system from the other entry. Which kind of makes sense. Ooh. And I can save this. So I save the initial state. Uh, let's see. Those are pretty outside too. Hold on, I need to check out before I start. I just like to get my bearings, like, so I don't, I'm not like... I'm not, um... How can the Brady? I don't like to kind of be like, um... Rushing, like, when the game's going on. Our smart planters gather all the data about the plant, so you can use gardening tool to get all the information. Plantainers also help you with planting seeds onto the ground. Just equip the seed bag and click on it. If you feel lazy, you can also just dump them onto the soil. Okay. Ooh. It's quite big. I, I like the style of this. Ooh. There's like a tube here. Oh, I see. Okay. Oh, wait. Is there like a cover? What? This is big. Ooh. There's water. I don't like the graphical style. It's like like simple, but very, like kind of cartoonish kind of style. But it's very like um, pretty like looking. Can I slide down? <gasps> Yay! Wee! Oh my god! It's this is really cool. Okay, I don't like how it's like working with a the theme of like. The cloud home, there's like a things here, we've got like a floating islands, and this is itself like a floating island. I like these trees, these are like nice red trees. There's a thing here, okay. Shop, okay. There are companies in Toronto Concerns to Soul, you can buy new seeds, tools, and more of our patented plantainers, they can help you make the job easier. Provide upgrades and expand your planting area, but make sure you buy the correct seeds for the right plantainer. Okay. <gasps> Watermelon seeds, bean seeds. That's how much time they need. Beetroot, wheat seeds. Okay. Stools, you can buy tools, small watering can. Structures, small patch. Oh, you can buy these too. Okay, extras. Small. Oh, so this is like a decoration, I guess. I don't know if they. To do any, to do any function, but I'll see. This is cool. This is a really big too. I do like like how expansive this is because a lot of the games they feel like it's just a small area, but this one feels like very nicely kind of populated. Look at like these air rocks. 
Ooh. That's very nice style to it. Oh, there's like a lot of... So I guess this is like area where I could like plant stuff. It seems like... Um... It seems like it's kind of barren right now. It's a very cozy look to it. That's like moss. Okay. Okay, okay, so... There's the tube, it's going to the house. Uh, what else is there? Build orbs. Build orbs are like zip files that contain deflated body materials and the blueprint of what you want to create. Your gardening tool can inflate materials and build it for you. Just switch to the building mode on your radio menu, pop one of these orbs and see the magic happen. Okay. Then we've got... Um, with our advanced watering cans, you can carry less water. Wait, what? You can carry less water than with a normal one. This is initiative from that keeps you fit and oh my god, <laughs> fit and healthy. I was like, less water? That doesn't seem right. You fit and healthy even if we, if we are not around. Make sure you always keep an eye on your plantainers as plants at this altitude grow faster and will grow slower if they use up all their water. This way we lose time and will cause direct impact on our profits, which will be reported with unsatisfactory mole mark. Oh my god. Okay. And because some. Oh my god, you can actually lay down. <laughs> I also actually turn my multimeter a little bit higher because there's like music and sounds and everything. There we go. Oh, there's another bench here. Can I sit here? I can sit down. Oh, I can sit down on the bench and just watch. But I'm actually gonna st get started. So I think I s went through everything. It just looks so dusk. Can you? Drink these? Nope. Soda pip. Okay. So I guess I'm ready to get started, I think. So I got my bearings, so I'm gonna grab the tool. And got no plant found. So like do I literally just like start doing stuff? Like, I don't think there's, there's like any, like, start button, so I think I'm, like, ready to go. Welcome. The game is paused when the host isn't focused. Okay, so it's just a thing. Oh, there we go, world settings. They got language. Ooh, okay, so they got, um... They got, like, a nice selection of languages. They got, like, Polish, Spanish, Japanese, French, Korean, German, Russian, Spanish. I mention on low quality mode. Tutorial hints, music volume, dinner cycle. Yeah, I'm just gonna keep it default. But it's nice to have those settings. Okay, so who cleans debris? Oh, there we go. So this does something. No plant found. So what is this? Uh, smart about the plants. So we can use. Uh, so we can use. Plants. Does this do anything? Do I put this here? What do I do? Wait, uh, planter is also planting seeds, just equip seed bag and... Oh, you can equip it. Oh, so I just click on it. Oh no! It went the wrong way. Oh, there we go. Okay, okay. Oh, so that's 616. Wheat. It has water. There we go. And I see how it's growing. Okay. And it's becoming dark. Okay, so I guess I need to water them. There we go, it's gonna make them go faster. There we go. How do I refill this? Do I just put this here or...? Okay, it just needs to be put there, there we go. What are these? Carrots? Okay. It's dark. I don't know what this does. I like how this is like a dingy thing. There we go. Got nice water. I'm just gonna put this here. It's gonna recharge and... No, I kind of wish it was there now. 
It's hard to see things. Oh, there we go, they're like nice growing wheat. Okay. Ooh, let me actually check the place out at night. Like, it's very nice. Okay, and can you buy more of these? There's like airships there. Oh, like it's glowing in the cave. Let's go through this again. We let's go again. Wah. Okay, so there's a bunch of places. So the hole cleans the debris. Oh wait, did I? Oh yeah, this is the shop. Okay. So there's a shop here. Um, let's go back. Can I just? I'm just gonna jump over. There we go. I'm gonna wait for the day before I do more stuff. I think. Oh. So these are seventy-four percent grown. The water's not getting used up that fast as I thought. There we go. I think it's getting day. Build orbs. There we go. Now it's looking all nice. How cleans the breeze? So we've got ninety-one percent grown, fifty-seven percent grown. So I think these are gonna be like ready to like harvest. Let's see what this does. Um, so put this here. So do I just place this anywhere? Can I just be like, how do I, how do I like shoot this? Do I need to clean the debris first? Okay. Okay. Ooh, okay. I didn't actually give me stuff. Oh, this one takes a while. Come on. Come on. Almost. There we go. Can I plant stuff now? How do I plant stuff? Oh, it's set us. Oh, okay, so it's GMT scanning. GMT building. Okay. Dismantling. Harvesting. Okay, so there's a little one most of this. Oh, I see. Okay. Okay, so I cannot place it when there's a debris. Uh, but I can place it here. So, let's put this... Uh, uh, I wish I could like turn it this way to align it. So I'm gonna put this here. Okay. So I can change it to scanning. So I think this one's ready to harvest. Harvesting? <gasps> oh my god, it's cool. <gasps> that is cool. Okay, so I got it harvested. So what do I do now? Do I need to deposit it? Does it need to go there? Does it go here? Oh my god, it does, okay. Silo. There we go, I got, uh, I got a bunch there now, I think. Let me see if I can plant some more. Uh, planting and scanning. Let's see the carrots. I wish it was like just scanning possible. Okay, so these are ready to harvest. So I'm gonna harvest these. Keep, 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 keep. Nice, so I got 16 carrots. Uh, let's see. So carrot, it's like one time, so like if I drop it here... Is this gonna... Oh, there we go, yeah, now it pops up, now it's in the silo. Does it actually go through the tubes? It goes into the silo. Um, silo, silo control panel can use a deposit manager or yield or sell them to us and return get. Okay, so like you can, I can sell stuff here. So if I sell the carrots, 
but I sell them. So I click it. I don't have to sell. Oh, oh, there we go. Oh, so I select it. Okay. I select it and say how much I want to sell. So if I select. There we go. And I got a bunch of the soul. Okay. Okay, so I can sell stuff here. Okay, that makes sense. So I guess I need to buy more seeds now. Um, I don't think there's any time rush right now, so it's actually, I kind of like that. Um, so let's go to the shop. Most house. So I can buy more seeds. So these are cheap. Okay, so I can buy. Let's buy four. Oh, okay. Oh, that is cool. Oh my god. What? This is the mall. I got 32. That is cute. Can I scan him? No plant found. Okay, let's. Let's, uh. Go plant these. Is this, this is gonna be. Okay, so that like planted uh, 16, and then I go here. Okay, 12. What if it's not enough for the whole thing? Is it gonna be like. Does it need to match? Okay, so like it needs to match the capacity, it seems. Um, so I can actually buy another small plot. So structures, I'm gonna buy a small patch. That is cool. And I can plant this. So I'll plant this here. Building... Oh, this is a bit different, okay. 12, I don't think this is gonna be... This is gonna fall it either, it's gonna be 4. Okay, so that's four. Um, gonna switch about the scanning. This is still has water, but the other ones don't. So I'm gonna. Oop, oop! Let me to do that. Come on. Water this. Oh my god! Yeah, I need to fill it again. Nope, not enough water. There we go. More water. And this needs more water. There we go, now it grows. Okay. So I could also buy more stuff. I'm gonna... I, wanna, I want some fruit, I want some watermelon. <gasps> I can make tulips too. And beetroot, I like beetroot. Watermelon. That requires a lot of water. So I'll, I'll buy some watermelon, uh, eggplant, bean seeds, I'm gonna get some tomatoes, they don't require like a lot of water. I like how it like also like randomizes, so like they don't like, they, they are not, um, what's the word? They're not like Z clipping, like Z fighting. Each other. Okay. So good watermelons. Uh, I think that's enough for this one, so I'll drop this here. Oh, okay. Oh, interesting. That's just four. Okay, so this is like taking more capacity. And it's eating a lot of water, I figure. Oh, that's very dark. Okay, can I get more lights? I want some, I want some lights there. Structures. So there's deep planting and a plant pot. What does that do? Uh, extra solar lamp. What do these do, solar lamps? Soil storing tube. Mold donation tube. What does that do? Oh, so I cannot get a large watering can. Oh, I can get a large one. Oh, that's gonna be useful. I don't think I can add more lights.
Okay, let me see. So these are fully grown, so I'm gonna harvest them. Nice. I wish I could put some lights here. There we go, good wheat. So I need more tomatoes and more eggplant for for this order. That's 25 bonus. So I'm growing some tomatoes. So I have tomatoes somewhere. Are these tomatoes? It's really dark here. Yeah, these have tomatoes. So I will plant tomatoes here. Oh, okay, there's also four. This is... I wish this was just like constantly scanning. It's a little bit... Okay, I can harvest this one. Oh yeah, I have to, I have to switch it. There we go. It's just four. Uh, more tomatoes. This is just gonna be one. Yeah, it literally just plants one. Oh, it's very dark. Got more wheat. Uh, need more tomatoes. There we go, it's getting daylight again. So this one, is this one ready? Scanning this one's ready, so I'm gonna harvest these. It's four more. I'm gonna plant another tomato here. So this one is a big one. Good wheat. Oh, these, these are growing... Does this need water? No, this still has some water, but it's like running out, so I'm gonna... Water it. Come on. There we go. Oh, there's tomatoes. I already have tomatoes here. I didn't use this. Okay. I didn't, I didn't even need to buy them, but it's gonna save me some time. I need to buy some eggplant. So this one's growing, this one's growing. They grow slow. These grow slow too. I need another plot, let me buy a plot. So... I can buy a small plantainer. I don't have enough for... I don't have enough for a big one. Unless I sell, I need to sell, uh, so they don't, wheat, okay, I have plenty of wheat, so I'll sell, I'll sell, like, some of it, I don't need to sell super much, I'm gonna sell 20, there we go, so this should be enough for, like, one of the larger, One of the larger ones. Uh, so I got enough for the small plantainer. What's the difference between patch and plantainer? Okay, let me get this one. Let me switch this to the building mode. Okay, what's the difference between these two? Scanning, so these are 50%, 56, 44. Um, ooh, what hormones are growing? 75, just still going. I need direct plants too. I'm gonna do a watermelon here. So it's just one, and I need to water it. Okay. Actually, hold on, let me get rid of some of the debris, because that also gives me some... That gives me more money. I should have probably been doing this at night. That's fine. Come on. Come on. Good 
going. There we go. I'm gonna get rid of the stump. There we go. Come on. This gives me more space. I wonder if the debris like will respawn in any way or if it's just like Okay there we go. Um let's see, these are still going. Oh that one's almost done. So I wonder if this one if the plantainer goes faster. Oh these are ready to harvest. Harvesting <gasps> watermelons, we got watermelons. <laughs> There we go, I didn't cover watermelons, so I can just sell them. I need tomatoes. Watermelon, they sell... Oh, wheat sets, sells for quite a bit. No, watermelon sells for, for quite a bit, okay. Um, do they want watermelon? I want to fulfill the first order, I need to get eggplant. So I'm gonna get eggplant. Uh, let's see, seeds, I have plant plenty. Oh my god, 69, nice. Uh, these are expensive, oh boy. So I got eggplants. I wonder how, what's the capacity, so... Okay, there's does two... <gasps> tomatoes! The tomatoes are growing. I wish I could get rid of the tutorial, so let's see. This is ready. Ah. Oh. Harvest, I'm gonna harvest this. So I got tomatoes. And I need to grow some eggplants. Where do my eggplants go? There we go. I'm gonna put some eggplants here. There we go, it's just one. This guy still has some water. This ones are growing. This ones are growing. Still has water. I'm gonna sell the tomatoes. Well, we're gonna put it into the silo. I actually wanna see. Does it like actually go through the tube? Can I? Can I like if I go fast enough? Can I see it going through the tube? I don't know. Okay, uh, let's see. So I got planted tomatoes, I just need eggplants. I got, like, watermelons. I could sell one, but... I got plenty of wheat, I could still sell wheat. And carrots. Okay, let's see. So these ones are growing. I don't want to be... Oh, this one's ready to harvest. There we go. So I got plenty of tomatoes for the order. Uh, so I'm gonna plant another eggplant here. There we go. Need to check on the water. This one's good. This one's good. They're good. Tomato. Still could water them a little bit, just to kind of replenish that. Yeah, so it's, it's, it is running a little bit low. Actually, wait, does the, like, more water make it go faster? Or is it just, like, needs to be above sea? Yeah. I think it does make it go faster. There we go. If it doesn't water in cans, make sure you always keep your plantains as plants at this thing grow faster and will grow slow. You use up all the water. Hmm. Okay, I was gonna get rid of some more of the... Oh, these are ready to harvest. 
small thing harvest thing. There we go, plenty of tomatoes. I need to focus on the eggplants now. So plant the eggplants. I think I might turn off the day night cycle because it's just making it's kinda of nice atmospherically, but like there's no lights. I don't think there's a way for me to add lights here. Um and it's really hard to see these I want to can like barely see. Oh, let me double check I can actually like because if I can get hold on, what if I dismantle it? Can I? Can I dismantle? I cannot dismantle this. Let me double check there's no like structures as plant pot. Is that for it just like a single plant? Externals, there's silo storing tube. Oh, is that so like I can just uh, solar lamp? Okay. Okay, so there's a lamp, so I could place lamps. You know what? I'm gonna I'm gonna keep the day night cycle. I'm gonna feel that makes it more part of the gameplay that way. And there we go, we're getting sun anyways, okay. Uh if only I could find my eggplants. Eggplant what oh, there's eggplants, okay. I'm gonna put them here, there we go, eggplants. Got the watermelon, there's more growing over here. Scanning, these are going. The watermelon is ready. I'm gonna. <sighs> the only thing I wish is like you couldn't, you didn't need to like switch the mode on this tool all the time. Okay, so I need eggplants. I'm gonna plant more of them. I think I should probably invest into some more plots. This is like one of those games like where it's like it's slow to start, I think, and like once you kinda get more stuff, like you get stuff you like you get things going. I need more carrots too. Um let's see. So these ones are uh growing. The plants are growing. They're slow, this one's faster. So I think the plantations are faster than the plots. I could buy more stuff, or well, I could sell some stuff because I have enough. I've planted to fulfill this order, so I can get rid of more wheat. So I need to keep ten wheat. So if I sell fourteen, that's gonna be fine, but it doesn't sell for much. I can still have enough. Um, the watermelons I can sell three. Can I type there? I cannot type there. Three, I can sell three, that's enough. Uh, I've got lots of tomatoes, i got like way more than I need. So I'm gonna... So the next order doesn't need tomatoes, I'm just gonna... I'm gonna keep nine. Uh, how much is that? 37 minus nine. Yeah, I was gonna let me give it ten, so I can sell this much. There we go, still good enough. Okay, I've got plenty to buy another plot. Plus I could get rid of the debris, I haven't been doing that. Um... Oh hey, these ones are getting... Ooh, nice, these are like growing, okay. Uh, let's see... I'll buy another plot. Structures, I want large patch. I want large plantain. I don't have enough for large plantainer. There's a deep plantainer. I wonder what that one does. Okay, I'm gonna get the deep one. I kinda curious what it does. So let's see if we can plant this one somewhere. Building why is it deep? Ooh! It is deep. Does it like make things grow faster? So there's like one eggplant in there and I need to water it. Scanning. So that's the water. It's going. 
Does it does it mean like it has like a lot of water capacity? This one's parched. I need to like do a test, maybe plant like two of them at the same time and see what it does. Smaller, smaller, smaller. It's just like plant. Are these? Oh, these ones are ready. Okay. Hold on, can I? I rotated my place space. So I can harvest this. <gasps> Yay, got six tank pass. Oh, that should be enough to fall for the order. Yeah, I just need mine, so I'm gonna drop this here. And this is going, and I can fall for the order. Oh, <gasps> nice. Ooh, that gave me a bit. Okay, so now I need carrots. I need beans. Beans, nice. Okay. I need watermelon. They don't care about wheat, so I can just sell. I don't have any wheat, I can sell it all. Um. I need carrots. Hold on, so I need carrots and I need beans. I have everything else. I got... No, I actually got too many eggplants. I mean, I can always sell them. So, carrots and beans. I need to buy some seeds. So, bean seeds. Good enough for these. And then I need carrots. Oh, hey, these are cheap. The beans are expensive. So, I'll try the beans. I'd like beans. Okay. Beans, and let's see if this has enough water. There's plenty of water. I'm gonna just. Oh, let's top it up. These ones... Need some more... Oh, this one's ready to harvest, this one's ready to harvest... This one's still going... This one keeps going, so I'm gonna harvest these... Harvest these, these ones are not ready to harvest. Can I harvest something that's not ready? I don't wanna, like, interrupt it, because... It's gonna take a good bit. Uh, I got plenty of eggplant. I need the beans and I need the carrots. So I'll use this one for the carrots. The beans are going and I'll plant carrots here. I'll plant them here and I'll plant them here. Actually, this is a good test to see like how fast they grow for both of them. So, if I... This one is 4%, 4%. Okay, see, these are... Growing. I wonder... Hold on. Actually, hold on. Does it make sense if I can only put this like where dirt is? And I can put these like where... Like anywhere. Like I could put them on the rock, for example. It's a lot of area to so you got these growing. Oh, these are almost done. I'm gonna harvest these in a sec. There we go, now they're done. Harvesting. There we go, I got plenty of eggplants and I can drop them in here. And now I can plant carrots in there. So uh what to do with my carrots? There's carrots. Uh, drop them here. I didn't go. I didn't want to go in there. Oh, wait, okay. Oh, so they're not compatible. Okay, so they do need the deep one. Okay, okay, okay. So, like, you can only plant them on certain type. So, I'll plant more beans in that case. Okay, okay, so carrots need a deep one. Yeah, okay, okay, I see, I see. So they only work with some of them. 
Uh, can I get a solar lamp? I kind of want, I want some light in there. Extras. Solar lamp. I don't have enough. I can get rid of some debris and get enough. I can sell some of the stuff too. Let me... What did I get rid of this tool? I should just keep it with me. There we go. Uh, so I got way more eggplant than I need. I need to keep six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, that's plenty of money. Um, oh, hey, there's another... Oh my god, I just noticed that one. I could have fulfilled that one. I mean, there's more eggplants on the way, I think. Actually, do I have more eggplants? I do, yes. Okay, but I can get the solar lamp. So, let me get one. There we go, I got a solar lamp. There we go. Is this gonna illuminate things? So, oh. Where can I put this? It's really dark. Okay, so this like works like this. Oh, okay, okay. That's small. Hold on, can I dismantle it? Okay, okay, okay. Dismantling. I was thinking to want to do that. Building. There we go, okay. That doesn't give us much light as I hoped. But it does mean like you can get light as part of the game, so... I'm gonna keep that scanning. So this one is... Almost done. They're still going. Uh, these ones are going. Carrots are going. Oh, these are almost done. Eggplant, almost done. This one's still going. So I'm gonna water stuff some more. So, I want the beans to have lots of water. Oh, carrots are done. Nice. Eggplant, this definitely needs more. I wonder what a deep one is for. It's probably something that requires a lot of like deep like. So this one is done, this one is done, this one is done. So I'm gonna harvest. Harvest this. Harvest this. Oh it just pops off, okay. It's smart. And it stacks, okay, that's clever. So I got the eggplants, perfect, I can fulfill the other order. And I can put this in. So I can fulfill this order. Oh wait, did the other order change? Like, do they just pop off? So I got carrots, I got the beans. I don't have the watermelon. Oh, did I sell the watermelon? Oh, I need more eggplants. Uh, let's see, I'm getting good money till now, so... It's getting a bit easier. This one's uh, scanning. Beans are done, okay. So I can harvest those. Good beans. Oh, these are the green beans. Okay. Drop the beans. Uh, scanning, these ones are still going. So... Better the carrots go. I have carrots somewhere. There's carrots, okay. So, I think I should be able to plant carrots here, but not here. No, wait, that works. Why does that work, and why didn't that work? Okay, I'm confused. I'm gonna plant another watermelon. There we go. Um. Oh, wait, can I hide the tutorials at this point? Yeah, I can hide them. Okay, there we go, they're gone. Uh... So good stuff planted. Uh, this is water. Oh, I can harvest this one. Beans. And this one's empty, okay. I need more. What do I need? To, uh, what do they want? Tomatoes. I definitely need more tomatoes, okay. I'll plant tomatoes. There we go. So I got these. This one's ready to harvest. Harvest. What if I harvest 
Okay, so I cannot harvest it when I just tried it on that one. Good, so I was hoping, like, a little bit worried if I, like, click it, it's gonna be, like, it's gonna harvest it and it's just gonna explode. I need more watermelon, too. Um, watermelon? I'm gonna put watermelon here. I don't know what the deep one is for. Like, I still don't understand, like, the difference between them scanning. These are done, okay. Beans, more beans. I don't want to dismantle this. There we go, lots of beans. There's a big yield. Okay, I have plenty of beans for the order. Need more eggplants, need more tomato. So, wait, hold on, which one do I need more gently? Scanning. So, tomatoes are growing. I need more watermelons. So, I'll. I've already put like a few, but I'll, I'll just get more. There we go. I was always gonna use wool for other orders too. So, there's water, this is water, water, water. I'm fine on water, tomato, this is definitely need more. Okay, water more definitely needs more water. Gonna top this up a bit. And water more, yeah, it's gonna want more water. There we go. Okay. I want more plantations, so because I wanna grow more stuff. So there's a large plantain. I have enough for the large one. So I'm gonna get death. There we go. And I can build this. Building, there we go. Okay, so I can get the next, another big one. There we go, okay. Well, interesting, why is it? Oh, is it like indicating how wet it is? So I'll plant more. I wanted more watermelons. Uh, I did plant the watermelons there. I need more tomatoes, I think. Eggplant. I need more eggplant too. Okay, I don't have enough eggplant. Um, do I still have eggplant seeds? I do. Okay, perfect. So I'll put eggplant here. There we go. Let's just use it up. Um, Just gonna adjust the camera a bit. Uh, where's my water thing? There we go. I'm gonna pour water there. There we go. Yeah, now it's nice and wet. Tomatoes are growing. This is going... Carrots. Oh, these are... No, these are done. Okay. I can harvest these. Got the carrots. Drop them in there. I got plenty, so I need more eggplants, more tomato. I just have some watermelons. I just need to wait on them. So these are going... These are going... Watermelons going... Oh wait, does this actually help them grow? Oh, watermelon's done. Okay, I can harvest it, and this one's not done. So I can harvest this one, but that's not enough. I'm gonna plant more watermelon. Oh, it's dark. It's got to be plenty of watermelon. And watermelons need a lot of water. Tomatoes, they're going, eggplants.
Still waiting on tomatoes. There's more eggplants. Okay, I'll definitely need a lot of water from now on. I'm not really getting rid of much of the debris so far. These ones are going. How much? Uh, can I see how much of the money do I have? 74. I need a little bit more to play by, but to buy more, need more stuff. Oh, this bathroom is not gonna be done in a second. There we go. Mine. Up there. I'm gonna plant more tomatoes, I think. Probably could use more tomatoes. Ah, oh no. There we go, I'm gonna give them more water. Just gonna top it up. I just want some more. I don't know if the one has like a lot of like water capacity or something. I still don't quite understand the difference. So my thing on tomatoes. Um, these ones are done. Okay. Harvesting, gonna get the tomatoes and I'll plant more. So that's 20. More tomatoes. And I can... Take this in here. And I just need, I need more eggplant too. Which one's eggplant? Okay, this is eggplant, so this is growing. Tomatoes are growing. These are growing. I'll need more eggplant at some point, I think. Um Let's see. There's a lot of like area too. Like this is this will be great like with a lot of people, like I wonder like if the amount of money is like shared for everyone. There we go, good. My farm. Uh let's see. So I can almost fulfill their order, I just need eggplants. These are eggplants, tomatoes, anything else? Everything's going now. The oh, water mod's done, okay well. I'll harvest the watermelon. Okay, I should have enough for, for a bunch of them. Yeah, I definitely need a lot of eggplant. I'm gonna buy some eggplant seeds. Because I see like those kinda coming up. I have like 69, so... I have just about enough for eggplants. Once these are done, okay, actually, I can plant it here. It's gonna be one eggplant. These ones are growing. These ones are 73%, 50%. Water mounts keep going. This is almost done. It'll be done soon. I'd have to see what the difference is because I'm gonna dismantle two of these and see like where if there's any difference in where I can place these. I got some tomato watermelon. I think I need water. No. I have to get a large. I have to get a large. Um... Let's see. These are. It's kind of good on water. I'll give them more fill. Eighty-four percent. You keep going. Okay, this one's ready to harvest. I think the water mounds are good now. Harvest those. Harvest those. Harvest those. Nice. Okay, I just need a plant to fulfill that order. 
I'll plant more of the eggplant. If I remember where I left it. Okay, here, there we go. You're gonna be... Oh, I wanted to dismantle it. Actually, hold on, let me... I'm a dummy. Uh, can I dismantle it when... Okay. Okay, I can dismantle it even when it has a thing in it. Building, so... Okay, so this cannot be placed on here. But it can be placed here, okay. So it does need to be on the dirt. I don't understand the difference then. I did waste like... Hmm. Oh, I know it to water it again. So you can dismantle something if it already has like... You can dismantle it if it's like... Has a plant, it'll just destroy the plant. That's good to know. Oh, are these ready? Nice. <gasps> these are ready. Dismantling. Harvesting. There we go. I need to make sure I don't do that like when it's actually... <gasps> and I can fulfill the order. I'm just gonna drop this here. And I'm gonna click fulfill. Nice. <gasps> and I can fulfill the next one too. Fulfill. Okay, now I need beetroot and watermelon. I have some watermelons coming, I think. Do I still have watermelons coming? I need to get beetroot. I have no beetroots at all. I haven't planted those yet. So I don't think I have any watermelons. It's tomato. So I will need... So I have lots of eggplants on the way, but... I need watermelons. I have two. Do I have more watermelons somewhere? No. What happens if it's not enough? Okay, so it needs to have enough. Um, I'm gonna get beetroot and watermelon. So I'm gonna get watermelon, I'm gonna go to plant the money down. And beetroot, where's beetroot? Beetroot scenes. Okay, perfect. So I'll put beetroot here. Okay, nice. Ooh, that fills it full. Uh, oh, it says beetroot. Like beet. B. Like B E A T instead of B E E T. Like a plant of water. I got tomatoes. Beetroot. So I'll need watermelon. These are ready. Uh, so harvest these and. Uh, what was the other thing I needed? Watermelons. I need more watermelons. I got them here. Come on. Can I plant them here? There we go. Got tomatoes. Got more tomatoes than I need for orders now. Let's see if I can get another big plantation so I can grow more, even more stuff. Structures, I get a large container. I wonder what a plant pot is. Is this like just for a single one? It's cheap, so I'm gonna get one. Okay. I wonder if we can just place it like one anywhere. So if I take this, can I... Oh, okay, so you can place that anywhere, so I can... Actually, I can't, okay. Interesting. Why can't I place it here? I can place it in middle. Is this, like, for a single plant? Like, is this, like, more decorative, or how does it work? I want to place a big one. I should probably move these in a bit. So I don't have to run as much. Okay, I really wish there was like a way to rotate these as you plant them. I don't have any watermelon here. Oh, let me plant the watermelon in this one. See if this works. Okay, that straight up just doesn't work. How about a tomato? It doesn't work either. Is it, is it like for the tulips? 
I wonder if you need it for tulips. Scanning, what remote are going? This needs more water, I'll have to plan. Uh, these are going. Tomatoes are done. Beetroot. Harvest these. What else do I need? Oh, there's more orders that are coming in. Carrot, pumpkin, okay. And wheat. I haven't done wheat in a while. Beans. Do I actually have wheat? I do have wheat, okay. So I can... Plant the wheat. Oh, it's not enough. All oh, right, okay. Can I plant it here? Okay, so I can plant wheat in this thing. Wait, what was the other thing I needed? So they want wheat or pumpkin. I need to buy pumpkin. I haven't done pumpkin yet. What's the pumpkin? Oh, that doesn't need much more water, but it takes a while. So pumpkin. Okay, that's four. I'm gonna use this one too for pumpkin. And I need to water these. Plant the water. Oh, this got fast. Ah, more water. Are these already done? They grow fast, I feel. Okay, let's harvest them. Oh, this is taking a while. 16, okay. Okay, so beans. Oh my god, there's another order, it just needs more time on. Bones 13%. I got plenty of beetroot, I need the watermelon. Uh, the full folded one. They also need beans, I've got enough beans. So I just need watermelon. I've got watermelon here, okay. I plant it here. There we go, and does it have enough water? It's there's water, it just needs to top up, I think. Pumpkin. The beetroots grow fast, I feel. Oh, this definitely needs water, it's just... parched. There we go, there we go. I got eggplant. This one's done. I'll wait on that one. Um. Oh, wait, this one. Wait, okay. So that's growing, it's just slow. That takes a lot of water. Okay. So it almost feels like it's more decorative. I don't know if there's like any functional difference. Okay, I got water mounts coming, eggplants, those will be done soon. I should like plant them every single time so I don't have to like run back and forth that much. It's also carrots. Tulips, okay, they need tulips. I do want to buy tulips, I want to see what they look like. So, let me buy some tulips. Are they cheap? I they go really fast. Let's go, let's try tulips. So, this one will be soon. Pumpkin, this is pumpkin, this is watermelon. This is wheat. Watermelon, eggplant. I mean, I'm gonna plant them. I don't wanna see the tulips. Shoop. Uh, tulips, drop this here. I think it's more water, these are like dry. Watermelon, they need some watermelons on the way. I'm actually getting hung from this. Okay, so this looks dry. Yeah, this. 
Okay. It's gonna be almost on hold now. Let me do tulips. I want them to grow fast. Oh, this is parched completely. I need a bigger one. Oh. I'll... Sure, the water's not a big issue yet. I might like wanna have more. Oh, these are done. Perfect, and this is exactly what I need. I'm gonna harvest these, and I'm gonna I'm actually gonna plant more tulips because I see somebody needs them. Oh wait, is this? Oh, the tulips need something else. Interesting. They don't wanna go here. I mean, yep, it doesn't work with tulips. Okay. So good watermelon. Is that enough? I think it was eight. Yeah, that's not enough. I need more. I got more on the way. It's good. Uh, I will need more. What else is there? Pumpkin, carrot. I need more carrots too. Uh, do I have carrots here? So tulips, carrots. I know the carrots that I want to go in there as well. So I wonder. I wonder... Uh, let me buy more carrots. Do I have enough? I have enough, okay. Carrot seeds. Oh, these are cheap. They're not very demanding either. Oop, I lost it. Come on. Carrots, there we go. Nice, okay. Anything else? It's being done, it's being ready. Scanning eggplant, okay, the eggplants are done, this one's almost done, almost done, okay. Pumpkin, these are almost done, watermelon, almost done. So we go harvest. Can harvest this one, harvest this one, perfect. Eggplants, I think that's... No, they need watermelon. Yeah, this is from This is a big order. So need watermelons. What else is there? So they need the carrots. They need pumpkins. I have pumpkins on the way. They need wheat. I need to buy more wheat. These are super cheap. I almost wonder like if I should have like bought a lot of these before I started like doing the orders because they feel like way Well then again I don't get too much for them, so I wonder like if strategy wise if that would work. Um Oh yeah, I wanted to dismantle these, hold on. So these are done. This is almost done. These are almost done. Okay, I'll just wait a little bit and I'll have these carrots. And dismantle these. There we go. Why do we just done? Gonna harvest one wheat. Oh my god. It's not even marked. <laughs> that was a test of the pot. I don't wanna put... What else can I put in there? Can I like put a pumpkin in there? Nope. Doesn't like that. <gasps> I can harvest these. I can harvest these. I can harvest these. Oh, I got like a lot of... There we go, and now I'm gonna drop this here. Let's see. <gasps> I can fulfill this order, nice. Now I need carrots for this one. I need more watermelon and beetroot, and so if I get watermelon... Wait, do I have not enough watermelon? I thought I had enough, never mind. I'm gonna plant more. Uh, more here. Alright, then wheat, I need wheat. 
I'm gonna plant wheat here. There we go. How about the tulips? Uh, are the tulips ready? It's kind of dark. Should put some of these uh, beans. What do I do? Where's the water? Water in can. There we go. Oh yeah, this definitely needs water. It's very dark. Oh, this needs water. This is what did I? And this one needs some water. There we go. Our cars are done. Okay, we'll harvest those. That's taking a while. Okay. And I'll plant more wheat, I think. I have... can't go wrong with wheat. There we go. So, that order needs watermelon to wait. Did I plant watermelon? I think I did. This is watermelon. Yeah, I got plenty of watermelon coming. So can I buy another big one? Let's see. Okay, I got enough, maybe? Yeah, I've got, I've got like barely enough for the large plant in there, but there we go. Still don't understand the difference between like the patch and plant in there, though. It seems like maybe they're not compatible with certain types of plants. There we go, I'm gonna put this in here and then I can Let's get more tulips. Oh, is that not enough? Maybe I need 16 for that. Tomatoes, there's so many tomatoes. So I got watermelon. There's more tulips. Oh, I already wanted to harvest those. Harvesting. Got my tulips. Um, can plant more. There we go. I'm going to plant another tulip here. There we go, that makes sense. I don't have enough to sell yet. Then it's seven. Well, it's going to be enough after the next batch. I don't need to plant something big. I don't have beans. I can just plant these, maybe? Is that enough? No, that is enough, okay. Uh, so this keep going. Is this ready? I think this is ready. No, it's not ready. Good more tulips, um, pumpkins, watermelon. Where do I put the small patches? I'll install them here. Building. Put them next to this one. Put this here. And put this here, and I can plant the tulips in there. If I remember where they are. I'm gonna put two loops in here. That's not gonna be enough for this one, yeah, not enough. Um, can I plant tomatoes maybe? I'm just gonna put these here. These are like the extra ones. Make sure this have enough water. How do we do? It's almost done. Okay. No, it's done. I can play this for a while. It's gonna be a lot of fun with a lot of people, I feel, because like there's a lot of space, but I'm better like even using like this. The beans are going. The tulip is going. Need more water. I wonder if there's like any like end goal or we're just gonna keep going and it's more of those like you know you're building like a place. This is way well done though. It's very polished. 
Okay, so I can harvest stuff. So I can harvest this. I can harvest this. Uh, the big harvest. Ooh, nice, 32. Can I harvest these? I can harvest these. Nice, I got watermelon, which is exactly what I need to do. So I'll drop this here and I should be able to fulfill this order. I can fulfill both of them. So I can fulfill this one. And now I can fulfill the other one. I need a little bit more beetroot. Uh, do I have any beetroot on the way? Is there any beetroot? It's got beans. Beetroot. I need to buy more beetroot, I think. Seeds. Beetroot. Oops. Keep dropping it. Beetroots, there we go. Watermelons, I can harvest those. What else is in the pipeline? Tulips, I need more tulips. Definitely more beetroot and more water. Where's tulips? Actually, I need to buy more tulips, I think. To make a big... They're super cheap, too. There we go, it's gonna be full of tulips. Where else? I'm gonna get beans. I forget how many how many are beans. Oh good, perfect. That worked out. And I got another plot. Uh, I'm gonna just get tomatoes. I got plenty of these, okay. Plenty of seeds. Uh tulip beetroot. It's the other more others. This one gives just 13% bonus though. It's not super much. These are going. Scanning, these are done, these are not done. So I got these. So I can harvest these. And I'll put... Um, I just get rid of these two tomatoes. One tomato, okay. So... Got tulip, there we go. I need carrots. The beetroot is the beetroot growing. The beetroots are tulip, beetroot, that goes fast. Uh, what do they want? I need carrots. I'm missing three carrots. I should have planted carrots. Uh, do I have any more carrots here? Did I use them all? So another tulip here. Yeah, I should have. Let me see if I can get another plantation and then... Do I have enough? I do have enough, but... Okay, carrots. I got enough for carrots and... Then I could another large plantainer. So, you know, now it's starting to kind of pick up the speed. This works really nice with the skybox too. I really like that, so... Um... Actually, I'm getting now to the point where there's uh, some debris I'm trying to get rid of. There we go. Carrots. There we go. And I need to water these. Ah, I keep getting rid of the tool. Should just keep it in my hand. I'm gonna set it to scanning so I know how much this needs. Beetroot, tulips. That was done. Get more beans here. Oh my god, I want beans now. Tomato. Beans. This is almost done. Carrot. Yeah, I should have gotten more water. Let's see. There we go. Tomato. Oh, this one's dry. There we go. Okay, these are done. So we can harvest these. 
Nothing else is done. These are done. I like how it like just like pops off when it's done. Come on. These are not done. These are not done. Hot salties. Oh, there's one there. Is there another one there? Oh, they just want beetroot. Wait, did I just harvest beetroot? No. I don't need more beetroot. This is beetroot. Oh, there we go. Now it's already. Okay, perfect, perfect. It's got beetroot, and this one's not ready yet. These are still going. So I can give them their beetroot. Carrots. I like it better. I'm gonna fulfill this one since it's the biggest bonus. Then I can fulfill this one. And if I get beetroot and carrot. I don't have more beetroot. So I don't need carrots. Get tomatoes. Carrots are underway. These are on the way to tomatoes, carrots, beetroot. Any more beetroot? Do I have beetroot seeds? Nothing with beetroot seeds. I'm gonna get more beetroot. Scenes. Let's get these. Let's plant them. And more carrots. Carrots are on the way. I'm just gonna preemptive plant some like plants. These are still going. I'm gonna get rid of tomato. What else is there? Beans are already for harvest. I'm gonna plant more pumpkins preemptively. I don't know if anybody needs them, but I'm getting rid of that thing. So got these. Um, I planted more beetroot. Got more tomatoes. The carrots are not ready still. I wonder if I can get this already done before another one pops in. I'm trying to go quick. So let's scan this. Carrots are almost done. I'm gonna need beetroot. So I'm gonna make sure to water these so they go as fast as they can. Come on, beetroot. Go quick. We get lots of water and carrots. <gasps> carrots are done. I'm gonna harvest them. Like I can, I like how I can just be the. Oh, this is <laughs> the flying and come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Beetroots, no beetroots, please. Beetroots. Are just beetroots? Scanning, forty percent. They keep going. They're fast. I'm gonna put more tulips here. It doesn't even go in there. What? Ah, oh, it's maybe not enough. Maybe I'll like plant. Just getting rid of these. There we go. Like plants. Like plant. Beetroot, come on. I've got time, I've got time, I've got time if this grows fast. Just gonna harvest the single tulip. Harvest. Come on, I can fulfill the order. If this grows fast enough. Beetroot, please. Please. I'll see if anything happens if I like fulfill all the orders once this looks dry. Yeah, this looks dry. Seventy percent pumpkin. Come on, Peter. 
turrets. Oh, there's another one already. Didn't make it in time. Can I? Oh my god, I can fall for this. Wait, I can fall for this one. Oh, there's a bunch. So fall for this one. And I can. I have a little more to metal now. Okay, let me just see if I can buy more stuff. Structures. Ooh, I got a lot of money now. I can buy two of these. 420, nice. Okay, I'll need to get rid of this. I'm on I'm just gonna put this here. And get watermelons. Do I have watermelons? I do, but that might have been... Uh, I don't think this is enough. Yeah, this is not enough. I need to get watermelons. Watermelons. I'm cheating with double jump. Watermelons, watermelons. And I need to water them, definitely need a lot of water. But we are going. Away. Go, plant the water. These are ready to harvest. Harvest of these. Oh, I can just run back here and. Come on. Pumpkin, I need pumpkin. Do I have pumpkin growing? I do have pumpkin growing. What else is there? Hold on, let me see. Don't like to water them all. I've got water them all too. I got pot on the way. Can harvest these tomatoes. Plant of tomatoes. Good weed. I can plant like one weed here. It's not very efficient, but good tomatoes. I don't think that's enough for the plant. Nope. I need to buy more seeds. The lips. Uh, got like one eggplant too. Right, can I get that? I can get more watermelons. This one's empty, so I'll just. Make sure this is actually using uh watermelon. Pumpkins, pumpkins are going. Let me make sure they have enough water. There's enough water here. Let's not use more water. They're almost done. They look so small. Like for about like for being like 90%. But watermelons they're eating the water. There we go, we got more water. There's no plant in there. I don't know if these small ones are even worth it. What's the wrong one? They keep going. Okay, I think these are harder to harvest. Yep. Oh, these go fast. Doing an eggplant. Oh, there's even more orders now. I can fulfill this one. Watermelon. Wait, what do they want? They want watermelon and eggplant. Do I have eggplant coming? I should have eggplant. Yes, eggplant, come here. Mark plant? No. There's more eggplant. Well, I don't have enough for this one. 
So I can, can fulfill this order and then I just need watermelons. Let me check their state. Watermelons. Scanning 71, 72%. They're going. They might be fast enough. Okay. I can fulfill this order and I just need the watermelons. Come on, watermelons. Please. Be fast. Let's see if anything happens if I get rid of all the orders. Might just nothing will happen. It will just be empty for a little bit. But I wanna see. I wanna see if I can make it. That's my personal goal right now. 82% good water. Plenty of water. You wash your mouth, you like water. Yeah. You can harvest these. Plenty of tomatoes. Watermelons, come on. Come on. 91%, 91%. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Eggplant is, eggplant is almost done too. 95%, come on. You're almost done. You're almost done. Watermelon, this one's not fast enough. 98%, oh come on, come on, come on, almost done, almost done, almost done, almost done, almost done. Okay, it's gonna be here today. Come on, <gasps> thank you, come, 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 come. Ah, 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 come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Uh, yes, I did all. Oh my god, nothing happens. I figured. Still, I did it. I did all of them. <gasps> okay, let me. I want to check some other stuff now. It feels like I could like spend quite a bit of time here, especially if it's like with multiple people. Ah, uh, so there's tools. I can get more hose. Can get large watering can. I've got plenty for that. I don't. A bunch of extra small water fountain, large water fountain, sile storing tube. I wonder what that does. Small donation tube. I want to see what that is. Not the most unusual. I think the silo storing tube is like so you don't have to run as far. As uh, deep container. Let me get the large plant. Oh, nice. Okay, so it just literally pops out. Um, are there any plants I haven't tried yet? I tried all the plants, okay, so... Got tools, got a large... Um, let me see... I'll try to get a silo too, because I want to see how that works. I feel I don't need it yet, because like this is small enough and there's like lots of space here to like make a really big farm, but... Um, let me see... Let's make a big one... Oh, yeah, I wanted to see the mold donation tube. I wonder what it does. Oh, wait, you can. Where? Oh, hold on. Oh, okay, hold on. I just noticed an option. So you can split this. Take half. Oh, that is cool. Can it combine? Oh, you can combine them. That is awesome. Okay. That is awesome. I'm gonna put this here. Okay, I do want to see what, the, what this is. Building. Can I put this in here or can I put this? Hmm, can I put it too close then? Okay, I'll put this here. What does this do? Can I like give plants there? So like if I harvest this. Okay. Is there like a trash can essentially? Like like does just donate? Do you want some water? Okay, it's not enough wheat here, 
also got tulips and some eggplants and watermelons. Yeah, I'm getting all these like little. Can I give them this too? Like, do they want this? No, okay, so they don't. They only want harvest. Okay. And there's more orders that came in. Okay. Uh, so I give them watermelons, um, which I needed to sell. Let's see if this goes here. Nope, yeah, I can put them here. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Can harvest these. It's like harvestable. But what was the point of that? And these are harvestable. Okay, I got watermelons. Nice. Okay, perfect. So I can sell these. I don't have carrots. I need more tulips too. I mean, I can just sell them like that without fulfilling the orders, but it feels like the orders are like the best way to kind of like get money. So let me get more tulips. Uh, more carrots. I don't know why I would want to do the donation, like give it like as an interactivity or anything at all. There we go, okay, that's all of them, and tulips. Nice, okay. Also, I wanted to test this, but I didn't do it. So I can dismantle this and I can put this elsewhere too. Okay, so I can... I can place the fodder foot and there we go, so I can relocate it. It's this object like any other, and you can buy more. So that makes sense. Um, okay, just gonna make sure there's plenty of water. So I think I'm just gonna try the. I wanna try the tube, so I'm gonna get enough money for that. Um, but I think I'll probably leave it at that point. I don't think that's enough for this. Let me see if I can fulfill an order. Uh, I need the tulips. The tulips are going. I need carrots. Do I have carrots? Like plants, what are on there? Carrots. I need carrots. Did I buy carrots? Did I plant carrots? I don't... I did, okay. Yeah, okay, they're going. Scanning, these are going. These are going. So, four for those two orders, and I think I'll be good for this experience. This is really, really good. It's, like, very polished. And I feel like this, could, like, this is gonna be a lot of fun with lots of people. It would kind of maybe need, like... I mean, kind of fulfilling the orders, so, like... That's sort of like a goal, but I wonder if it's like even like bigger goal, like even like more items that it could like, you know, buy and sell, like something that's more expensive, because I feel like I kind of got most of it, I tried like most of it, so like there's not like super specific things to do at this point, other than just like, you know, the relaxing nature of it. Um, okay, these are done. So I'll harvest these. These are not harvestable yet. Um, I need carrots, I need the carrots. I'm actually see what happens if I disable the day night cycle. So if I disable it, I can change the time of the day. Okay, so I can make it just permanently daylight. Oh, it went too far. I don't like... That's pretty nice, it actually shows the time of the day on the thing. Can I harvest? Yeah, these are harvestable. So let's harvest these. And these are not ready yet. Tulips, beetroot. I can fulfill that one. Okay, I should have enough for the tube now, so let me give that a try. So I can buy the Sile Storing Tube. Okay. 
There we go, okay. Also, I like how it has like little like solar panel on it. Building, so I think what this pretty much does is like I don't need to like run too far for like I don't need to run all the way over there to like store these things, so Cushion pressure. See if I harvest more stuff. Okay, the carrots are ready. So I can harvest these. I can just put them here. Yep. And it goes there. Oh, wait. I want to see if it actually goes... Oh, it does. Okay. Oh my god. It goes through there. Hold on. I need to do that again. Uh, is there anything to harvest? I can't stop planting stuff. Um... Then I'm just gonna... Oh wait, I can fulfill the other order, I think. Nope. Oh, and it's wheat. Oh my god, it's literally one wheat short. <laughs> There's a single wheat. This is exactly what I need. This is very well done, okay. So it's almost gonna be done, then I can fulfill that order and buy more stuff. Actually, wait, I'm just gonna relocate this thing. So I wanna dismantle this. I'll place it here. So I'll place this here. And then I can watch it go through there. I'm gonna harvest this. Okay, right. So we're gonna drop this here. Actually, let me go. Oh! Oh my god, yeah. There it goes. There it goes. That is really cool. And I'll have enough to fulfill the other order. So, if I go here, I can fulfill this. So, and now what's super cool thing about this is like, I should be able to save this. So it's using the system, my farm. I have 236, 13 of these. So I'm gonna save my farm. And it's like writing that. And I can see like the entities being written. And I should be able to save this now. So I can actually save the progress of this. I'm gonna save this to inventory. So if I destroy this, and I'm gonna do a new farm, really. It's making a new one. Okay, all the stuff is gone. I think it might repopulate some other stuff. I wonder what the low quality mode does. Oh, like the disables like shadows and stuff like that. Okay. So music volume, time of day, time. Game time scale. Does it like speed up the growth and everything? Ten times. Wait, does that Oh you can change the cycle speed too? So this is gonna be really fast the cycle. I really like the these orange trees, they're like super pretty, they're like nice and glowing. It almost looks like subsurface scattering kind of thing. Okay, so this is the starting one. So if I do this, it should be growing way faster now. Okay, so it's pretty much like reset the game to the starting state. And it should be growing super fast now, I guess. Yeah, it's hold on, let me grab all of the tools. Yeah, this is this is going so we can speed it up. If it's like too slow for you, we can speed it up and then have like Okay, those are cool options. So this is the other farm and now So this is the default farm and I've like changed this and if I change this um if I spawn my farm Put it there, I can load it and it's gonna load it in. stuff gonna pop in. It's 
loading. Oh, there we go. Yeah, I got all my stuff. That is really cool. I'm gonna disable the cycle speed and just gonna change it to daytime. There we go. Yeah, so I just loaded the state of like everything. I've got like this tube like over here. This is really cool. This is super, super, super cool. You don't need to like, you know, even save the, you don't need to save the entire world. You can just, you know, you save. So like if they like make updates to the game, you should be able to like just plop your save state. This is like both like very like technically like impressive and like even just like kind of the amount of like polish like put into this like this is a very cool world um a very cool game and i kind of need to try it like with multiple people too because this feels like it's gonna let me actually see what happens if i jump off i'm just gonna fall off Oop, there we go pops it back here this is very cool. And got lots of like li nice little details. And lots of like like technically impressive systems. The gameplay it feels pretty good. Like it's um like a lot of games that can have this kind of like more kind of janky feel to them, but this feels a lot more kind of like polished and uh fun in terms of the play style. I think to like would love them to also see like you know continue this and like build upon this mechanic like because if we are even like more things and I feel like they they have like really like strong base for the game and if they keep like adding say like more missions and stuff like that and more things you can grow like so there's like more of a more growth like cute like curve maybe even like you know some decorative items like so you can actually like invest some of the money like you know into making like a cool cool things in here, like that would be like awesome, but this is very, very impressive what they built. Oh, there's like one more thing I need to try. Can I fill the bucket with water like in that pond? One second, I'm finish falling. Okay, uh, let me check that. So I got my water can. So I'm gonna empty it. So now it's empty. I wonder, can I fill it in here? Nope. No, it doesn't fill. Ah. Yeah, but it's just detail. Okay. So this was the Cloudscape, Cloudscape Harvest by the Hardlight. I really like they also like like made it like in the theme of the cloud home, so it feels like you know it's like one of the islands that you can kind of go into in here. It was very good. Uh, so let's see how long I've been going. I've been going for 2 hours and 30 minutes. Um, I think I'll keep going for a bit more. I might need to take a break for food and then do another video. Um, let's see, so this one I'm pretty sure requires multiple players. There's Zerzadoid Mafia, so I think that one will require more people. Um, there's another game. I think this will probably require more people too. Um, yeah, this will probably cause more people. The let's see. I see like there's any short ones kind of left. Uh, it's a full body hoverboard. I need to get into full body for that, so I might do that in a bit. Oh, there we go. So the next that looks shorter is the Cadets Resonite Hangout by Archer42. This is in the world's social category, so let's explore it one. Can I get this a bit to load? I think I'll probably cap it off after this one and split it into next video because this one's all up. This one's gonna be pushing like three hours in a bit. Gonna give this time to load. I thought this looks big ish. Oop, oh no, yeah, I should probably move.
There we go. So we've got credits, the member of Alphabetical Order, Archer Fortress 2, Atisa, God Legion, Karen VR, Lance Whiskey 3D, Richmore, Stand with Trees, and Xoxic. I don't know how to pronounce that one. <laughs> Collaborators, Playtesters, Adrios, Kundalaj, Kurt, David Turner, Light Control, Luke Nate Walker, Medra, Fund, Projectivity, Erta, and Talakai. So we got Lance Whiskey 3D Modeler. And uh, there's more credits. Oh, this is the same thing. Interesting, I think. Okay. So there's a lot of statues. Oh, is there like all the people like who worked on this? This Hori Eng. There is like different places. So let's go. So there's a T cell project design. Or is this cool? So like they incorporate like people who worked on this into the So we got the uh, exotic. There's Gordon Legion, Sirichmore, Statue Creator, Archer 42, Golden DD, oh nice they can all together, Stand with Trees, and Karen VR. I like how they like made it like marble texture, like sort of kind of statue-like on these. So here is like this place. It's kind of interesting because this looks like ice almost, but it's I think it's like water. Okay, yeah, this is like a pool. Okay. Uh, I've got plans. I think how there's like these things like it's kind of flowing through as well. It's kind of like it's kind of connecting the water's like flowing through a whole space. It's not so nice. It's like auditorium, so you can like have people sitting and somebody presenting or playing something in here. Uh, what are those orbs? Are they like different places? Can you get to those? Feels like we're like with one of those like spheres. So I wonder like if they're like meant to be if they're like meant to be it's also interesting how they kind of tackle that thing. Let me make sure it shows on the camera. Because you cannot like tile these perfectly, but it's like these spots on this and kinda nice. Sort of water there. Um Let's go over here, it's like a area with some chairs kind of... Oh, we cannot sit on them. Um, there's a little garden here, it's got like some... Oh, berries can eat them. I wish you could eat them. Oh, oh this goes over here. Okay, so this connects through here and we have like an overview of the starting area. So you can go here and there's much... Let's look at the places. It looks like there's like a broken one as well. I wonder what happened there. It's like... Okay, there's another garden in here. This one looks similar to the other one. It's like symmetrical. But this place is different, so there's like... Where is this? Oh, there's like a bar. Okay. So you could like... Conserve drinks. Interesting. Okay. And this connects through here. So it seems like a kind of cool like social hangout place. Like how it's like in space and there's like an you know, indication there's like more of them too. I don't know if they actually have anything. I can try flying to them, but it doesn't look like there's... It doesn't look... Oh, is this a 3D scan? Is this a 3D scan? That's cool. I don't think there's like a way to get into those. I can get in here too. I don't think I'm supposed to be here too. Okay, so we got like a few buildings. I don't like how this place is kind of structured. It's like circles around. Okay, let me try fly to like one of those. Uh, that's the broken one too behind them. I think these are empty though. They don't look like they have anything in them. I'm probably not supposed to go into them, but I don't want to check them out. Just to be sure. Yeah, this looks empty. Yeah, I don't think I don't think I'm supposed to like go into these. It's kind of cool though, like like it kind of indicates you know just like bigger world with these like these kind of spheres. 
Okay, I'm gonna close this one. So this was the Cadet Sersonite Hangout by Archer42. So it was a relatively quick one. Um, I'll see there's a few more. I kind of want to knock out as many as I can. Uh, because there's still like a few games to get to. It might take like a bit. So at least I have like the smaller ones like out of the way. Uh, so this one, I don't know if I can test this. This is dual desktop dual inspector. So it's desktop utilities. So I cannot. Um, I don't think I can test this in VR. Let me. Let me start it up. Um, I should have shown the word orb. Let me actually go back. Actually, let me just spawn this one here. Good word orb. So this is the world I'm in. It's the desktop draw inspector by Epic Easton. Uh, 197. I wonder if it works like um, in here. This is what it would look like if it doesn't look like this. The panel is scalable, scalable should be the monitor. Um, press F9 and click the purple button on the inspector panel. I can actually just jump out of VR for a sec and do this. Okay, so there's a new button. Here's the tool. Select something, click additional button with help from Axel and autopilot. Um, so I'm going to jump out of VR. Um, give me a sec and I'm going to test this out. Okay, so I got my microphone. You'll still be able to hear me. I'm just gonna switch to the desktop mode. Uh, there we go. So this is gonna disable the camera. I'll close this for now. Um, let's see. So you're supposed to click the purple thing. So I'm gonna click this. And nothing happened. Oh, I need to press F6. Okay. Oh, sorry. There we go. Okay, so like it pins it to the screen. Uh, let me also hold on. I need to grab my headphones so I can attach my microphone so I don't have to keep holding it. There we go, okay. There we go. Yeah, come on, I need to bend my microphone. There we go. So, I should be able to move around. Okay, I do this cool, so it kind of splits it. And this is the tool that I think it's tied to, so I can... I can, like, go up here and edit stuff. I probably shouldn't have selected it. One out of all the things. Um, left hand, there we go. It's my left hand. And let me go somewhere else. Um, gonna center through Gonna select the body. And this is like the part that's. That is cool. So I can scroll. This is very cool. Okay. So I can go around. And. Say, I'm gonna edit something. Um, body material here. Where's the body material? Body, there's body material. So, I'll just change this. Okay, so it opens up like this. And I can make myself red, for example. Come on, why is it not? There we go. Okay, now I'm red. And now I'm green. And now I'm blue. Okay, this is really cool. I do what happens if I did this, or if I do this and I open this, is it gonna break it? Oh, it sort of breaks it, okay. Can I repin it? Oh, okay, so I just press it up. Oh, it gets mispositioned. Still works though, this. This is very cool. It's very really useful if you're like working on desktop, you get like quick access to the inspector and just stay spin to your screen. This is really, really cool. Uh, ok, 
Can I just select something else? Can I be like an inspector? Oh, it doesn't have that one. So how does it work with the tool? Deselect all. Uh, here's the tool, select something, click the additional button. I got the tool. Additional, open door inspector, okay. So can I just close this one? So I get rid of this one. And open door inspector. And it didn't work quite right, it seems. Let me try again. So I'm gonna select this. Open door inspector. Is it opened? It might be opened. Is it just misaligned? Oh, it's just misaligned. Okay. I don't know why it does that. Um, but can I just... There we go. Okay. Okay, so it works. So it's just a little bit glitchy, but... Um, and I can... Move the camera here. I can be like... Blah, 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 blah. Blah, blah, blah. Perfect. Okay. So this is really cool. Uh, so I'm gonna jump... I'm going to VR. There we go. I'm gonna jump back to VR. I'm gonna open the camera again. There we go. I'm still blue. Um, I got a big blah blah. Make sure everything is still recording fine. Yeah, very good, good. So I'm gonna close this. This is a very cool tool, for, specifically like for desktop users. Uh, so it was the desktop draw inspector by epic eastern 197 uh next we have the mmc 24 taria square by duma which is in the world social category so it's probably gonna be under the world to explore so let's open this one Oh, okay. It's loading in. Oh, there's some music too to it. Oh, I'm falling through. Yeah, I like the like light kind of rim theme. So we've got here is the Tadia Square. We've got a light tool so you can using the skybox. I like that like everybody like really likes to use the skybox. Special thanks to Nosit, by Team Tadia, the CPU and Duma, license, Skybox, in English and Japanese, and this looks kind of cool. So it's like there's like this open space that's kind of like pentagon. Is that pentagon or hexagon? Sized. We'll see from the top. And we've got like these platforms. So like let's walk up to these platforms. Bump. Oh, I like how like this like the trees and I can kind of see them around this. Oh, what are these? These are like it's like soft padded thing. It's like a ring there. I like like oh, there we go. Are these seats? Oh, I cannot sit on them. They're very like um. Maybe I'll just my micro. There we go. They're very like I like like the organic kind of shape of this. It's always like nice contrast and like so like more kind of like rigid architecture that's like very like strong angles and so on. Just like a sitting place here. And I can go like higher up. Looks very cozy here. It could use like a little bit more like furniture, I think, like furnishing. Oh, they got like places here. So yeah, so these are I think like like soft places where you can just like lie down. Some other tree here. Ooh, it's fuzzy grass. Oh, I like this. Just like another like garden-like area, like fuzzy grass, and you can sit in here. 
Ooh. I wonder what it looks like at, uh, at night. So I make it dark to make it all cool away. That's pretty. I can make it during daylight. I wanted to see what shape it is from the top. Let's see. Oh, it's not even... Oh, okay, it's not a regular shape. Okay. That's a pretty world. So, this was the MC Tadia. Tadia Square by Duma. Let's see what sticks on the list. Um, I think I've been through, like, majority of the worlds. Uh, oh, is this a different one? I swear I was... Was I already to this world? It's not showing us visited. There's the Dusk Mortuary home world, but I swear I already visited it one. Oh, that's odd. Uh... Okay, uh... Hold on. Much lower. So, let me double check. So there's the ground home, a dusk module home world shining here. I, I remember checking this one out, but for some reason the visit is not registered. Let me just open it up quick. I just need to double check this is the same one. Oh yeah, I've been to this one already. Yeah, this is like has the modular pieces. I thought it had like one before he loaded. This is weird. Like, did it get updated or something? This is odd. Okay, anyway, I've already been to this one, so I'm gonna close it. Um. So, that's that one out of the way. Uh, let's see what's next. So next there's the Cozy Train by Hamacorp. This is also in the world social category, so let's jump in there. I'm kinda pushing, I think I might be pushing over three hours now, but yeah, it's gonna be in a bit. Um I might do one more. Oh, it's music, I'm gonna lower the volume. Ooh, okay. This is definitely what it says, cozy train. This is like this is like soft fluffy ground. And there's and you're literally on a train. This is cool. You can like just like oh this is cool. Like you can just like lie down, it's like a little kid. And like you know, just watch riding through the city. Okay, I'm just like photos here. Good hammer curb. Oh, there goes, uh, you've got English, Japanese, Korean. Where's the music? I'm gonna lower this a bit. It's a little bit too loud. Portable settings and contest menu. It's Team Hamacorp. Team Hamo, Hamacorp, and Zao. Can I adjust the brightness? Ooh, I can make it like nice and dark. Ooh, I like how it like smooth too. Window tint. Oh, okay, so you can tint the windows. Can I go like all the way? Okay. That is cool, so I can make it nice and good. That is cool. Window 10. Is there anything else? There's uh, fog enabled. Can disable the fog. Oh, I see. I don't like it with the fog. Volume settings, strain. Is it scrolling? Horn vol. Oh, there's a horn. Okay. His preference is performance, particles, more particles, outside particle count, 
for materials out of the school. So you can disable the for materials. Train meshes. Oh, I don't think I want them on, but... Oh, it can is Oh, it is actually cool. So this disables the outside environment, so it looks like you're going through space, which is... Like, first not even a performance thing, this is almost like, you know, like... Ooh, oh my god, this is going through a building. Oh, that is neat. Let's just go through this thing. That is very neat. Um, colliders. I'm gonna keep them on. Mirror settings, resolution, shadows enabled. I think I'm gonna keep that. Uh, so let's go explore the other uh, high quality, low quality horror. Oh, oh, that's so cool. So like, you can enable like a mirror, and it's like a reflection, so you can kind of see yourself. It's like high quality, low quality. Oh, it's just a flat one. What else what do these do? Ninety degrees. Oh, does it make it go up? Ninety degrees, forty-five degrees. Hold on, make sure the high quality is on. I don't see myself. Oh, there we go. Okay. Oh, it's just at an angle. It's like if you're like lying down 90 degrees, that would be a thing completely up here, but it's like if you're like lying straight up down. This is very cool. Um, hold on, how does that work with the window tint? So if I tint the windows completely and go high quality, does that. Oh, that actually blocks that. Okay. I see, okay. I'm gonna disable it for performance. Ooh, I like how this power outlets do. It's a nice detail. Good your time. Like a robot. Okay, does this... Ooh! Okay. Oh, this is this looks dangerous. Can you fall off? Oh no! Uh, I guess you can. Okay, gotta be careful. Um, got like little kitchen area. Oh my god, orange! There's all orange. Uh, let's see. Oh, there's the video player. Are they synced? Is it the same one? I think they're synced. So you can be like watching something with people here. That is high quality. Where's the mirror here? Okay, it's on here. Oh, it's offset. That is weird. Wait, can you move the radio player? Okay, let's go through here. Oh, I got a computer. Oh my god, I got a VR headset. And it's actually because they're like resonate in it. The cloud home. Oh, okay, there's a good update. Bird. Good resonate. Good updates. Oh my god. The good blender. GeForce RTX. Good resonate cooler. Nice. It's RGB. Makes your CPU go faster. High quality. There we go. Okay. I like how the mirrors are like sort of like reflections on the window. Oh, is there another one here? I call it the... Oh! Okay, so this opens to the back. Which does... Okay, so this is this one. Wait, does this just... Is there a call either? Do I just die? I die. Okay. Oh, I can hide the video. There we go. Oh, and I can adjust it too. That is neat. So it can be like um, 0 degrees, 90 degrees, 45 degrees, I've got like a bunch of presets, that's really cool. Cover window, oh so you can cover a window, oh, okay, 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 that's cool. That's pretty cool world. I don't like this kind of like world like where it feels like you know it's not like static like you're kind of going through a place. This area specifically, this is I do like this area. 
and just like lay down and like watch the watch the like city go by. Oh, I can pick myself too. Okay. Can I actually go further? I can if I... Oh, okay. Yeah, that pushes me out. This is very cool. So, this was the cozy train by Hamacorp. It's a very cool social world. So, let's see what's next on the list. Uh, I might... I'll, I'll see if I want to go through another one, depending on how complex whatever next, whatever is next is. I think I might have been through most of the stuff, so like, if I go, let me just sort things by visit. Uh, but I'll be descending. So if I sort things by visit. So, close it around, do inspector. I think I kind of went through everything and I just have the worlds... I just have the worlds that require multiple players to go through. So, I'll see if I can cap up this video and then pretty much the next one I'll have to gather a few people and go through the wars that require more players. So, visited, visited, yeah, I'm just going through them, just double checking everything, make sure I haven't missed. Okay, so, oh, there's one more, I need a little bit of a prep for it, but pretty much like the last two worlds that I haven't even like went to for the first time is Snatch Company MC and there's a Night Mafia, and part of it is because I know those are gonna require multiple people just from the thumbnail and thing. But there's like one more that I can try that I haven't been to yet is the full body hoverboard um, by Rinfluff. Uh, so from the name, I assume I need full body. So I'm just gonna put it on. Um, so you're gonna see me fold into funny shape, I, I mean I could technically pause it, but I feel this is gonna be funnier. We'll just show this process. Oop, oop, it's tangled, come on. It makes it a little bit hard to judge though, because like, I, I don't think even all the judges have full body, so this might make it, um, This might make it kind of hard to judge for others, but um, I do have full body, I use it often, so like I don't have an issue going through it. Just putting my trackers on, waiting for them to turn on. There we go, I'm gonna put my feet on. And turn, turn into a pretzel. Oop. There we go. Gonna bank to my play space and I need to adjust my full body. There we go. So let's go in there. Should be moving, should be good. Should be good enough for the test. So let's see. So I got a bunch of protoflux here. Uh, so have a board. We started. Oh my god! We started on February twenty ninth. Um, Hopun assume comfortable stance on the board and hit calibrate. Press grip and trigger. One left, I'm gonna burn off, move your hips forward, to go forward till you're free to turn. Okay. There's a bunch of flux here, so like this, bring it back, oh my god. Um, 
Yeah, this is literally like, looks like it's just like in the middle of everything. It's a good uh, thing here. Tracker base controls. Hip tilts for back of speed. So let's, uh, let's up on this. Let's see if this works. So it says calibrate. I'm gonna hit the calibrate button. There we go. It's gonna work. I need to see the text again. Upon assume comfortable stance on the board. Press grip and trigger together. Okay, grip and trigger together on the left hand to trigger the board on and off. Okay. Grip and trigger together. There we go, now it's going. Okay, now how will this work? Just gonna adjust the camera so hips. Is it which way is it? So let me give this a time. I'm just gonna adjust the camera so that's a good view of what I'm doing. Okay, how do I do the hips? Is it like, am I in the right direction? Hmm. Can't figure it out. So this is the feet. I need to see the text again. One user activates. User assumes neutral stance with flat feet. Calibrate some sort of control on off. Uh, use foot rotation to turn hip forward back to speed up, slow down, back forward. Which which direction is forward? Is it like relative to the feet? Do I need to be like? I don't know which direction. Oh. Okay, so I have to turn this way, and then, how do the feet work? Like it does something, I have to like twist my leg a lot. This is difficult to use. So I have to like... Okay, so I have to be like this. Okay, so I know how to go forward, but I don't know how to turn. Turning is weird. Okay, so it registers, but I have to go really far. I have to like twist my leg a lot. And now it's turning. This is weird. I don't quite get it. You can like turn this way, but it feels counterintuitive. Yeah, this is weird, and I, I cannot twist it far enough to like go the other way. Feels a little bit difficult to use. It's probably not like polished enough, like in this version, hope it like. Sort of. There's like one thing I wish that the old could also go up and down, but like I'm having difficulty like in these two dimensions on her, just so I'm like. So this goes this way and this goes that way. Yeah, this is. I need to like twist my foot like really far to like 
go like has to be like this before it goes <laughs> it's hard to use maybe i do need to like go this way oh, this works better no this is still turning the wrong direction yeah this is really difficult to control <laughs> I wish it was like a video or something like showcasing how to do it, but um, it is a pretty cool concept though. Like things like, you know, for the full body, they kind of like, because it gives you like more kind of controls and um, it utilizes, utilizes kind of like, you know, the more like kind of motion inputs instead of like joysticks. I feel like it just needs kind of more, more of a like polish. And I did say like they started on twenty on twenty ninth, which is literally the last day. So if they like had more time, I feel like this would be kinda of, like more polished. It's like different versions of it. I can bring it back. This is just some oh yeah, I just put it there. Nice. Okay. And we gotta publish here. Calibrate debug. Debug. Oh, having good the debug shows like some things on it. Do I need to calibrate it again? Calibrate. This doesn't do anything that I can tell. Hmm. Oh. Anyway, this was the whole body hoverboard uh, by Rinfluff. And I think that's pretty much all for this video. And the next one, I only have like the... I should be through all the worlds now, except ones that require multiple people. Some of them I already visited to kind of check out. There's like two that I haven't went into yet. Um, so... Uh, I'm gonna do like another video, I need to get some food though first, and then like, you know, gather some people to help me like test those worlds. So, thank you very much for like watching this video, it's been pretty long, I'm, it's over three hours now. I think this is the longest one yet, but uh, I can go through all of the worlds except, you know, the multiplayer ones. Um, I'm almost through all the MMC entries, so thank you very much for watching, and I hope like I enjoyed like, um, you know, me going through the entries. And thank you also for like everyone who made like all these cool worlds that I like went through. It was really cool. So I'll see you with the next one, which I think should be the last video for this. So um, this is like the penult pen penultimate one. So thank you very much, and see you with the next one, the probably last one. Bye.